Let's learn more. Let's learn more. Let's learn more with liberty. The World Anti Slavery Convention was one of the biggest international gatherings at the time in opposition to the practice of slavery, which existed all around the world. Held in London in the year 1840, the convention set out to unite all the different anti-slavery advocates around the world and join together to end the practice of slavery. While this was certainly a noble and righteous goal, the convention soon became known for other reasons. In attendance were American activists like Elizabeth Cady Stanton and Lucretia Mott, who opposed slavery but were also passionate advocates for women's equality. Even though these women were talented and well-respected, they were barred from participating in the events of the convention, and they were told to sit off to themselves in a separate area and let the men participate in the convention. Of course, Elizabeth and Lucretia didn't like this one bit. They knew that they had talents and contributions to make too, and they thought it was unfair that they were being kept out due to their sex. As they left the convention together, they were determined to make a difference back home. They planned to host a convention in the United States aimed at advocating for the equal rights of women in America. There, the idea for the Seneca Falls Convention was born. The Seneca Falls Convention would eventually take place in 1848, and it helped kick off the women's rights movement in America, the effects of which are still felt to this very day.